Hi Aries, it's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. Let's get into it. Thank you, God, for blessing Aries with a clear, concise message from you. All right, let's see Aries. What's going on for Aries? How is Aries coming into the week? How is Aries coming into the week? How is Aries coming into the week? Okay, the three wands. That is your energy, Aries. Um, so some of you, are, you're definitely, you put something out there, you're waiting for it. This could be waiting for a package, a message. Um, you've also left something behind. So you're waiting for something to expand or you're waiting for travel news or you're waiting for something. You know, this is communication also. It says you might need to take the lead on this. Maybe even show others the way or this is what you're doing. You could be traveling to meet and communicate. I don't know what that could be about. Um, or this is what you do for work. What is the advice for Aries? Page of Swords. Um, do your research. Follow up. Ask the right questions with the Page of Swords. Um, you could be the subject of gossips, maybe even slander. Uh, watch your words. Watch what you say, how you say it. Okay. Um, somebody's reframing from having a whole lot of conversation with you because they don't want to have an argument. Or this is what you're doing. There could be spying. There could be lurking. This is also somebody looking at the tarot to gain knowledge you know about you or this is what you're doing in regards to something else or someone else what is the outcome if Aries takes the advice of the card this is also think outside of the box in order to bring in more money to make something real make a project real there's a relationship between you and someone that's very mental there's all of the mental agility that you have to do the mental gymnastics when you talk to this person it's never easy you have to come with it they come with it it's it's very tense it's very childish and it's petty what is the outcome here what's the outcome Six of Wands, whatever you're doing, you, you're going to be victorious in it, especially if you expand here, take the lead, follow up. You're going to get a promotion. You're going to succeed. You're going to get help in the matter of business or your own business. You're going to be the victor. People are going to see you um because you took some action. Something's happening fast, too. This is like fast action. Uh, maybe you get correspondence that allows you to be the victor. What is the Six of Wands for Aries? Strength card. So, yeah, um, other people's money. Merger. So, um, you could even be merging. Um, someone helped or helped you out um, with the Strength card. This is Emotional Intellect. Also, in terms of dealing with other people, this is governing yourself accordingly. This is um, knowing how to temper your emotions, being compassionate. So if you take the advice of the cards, you're going to have victory over, you know, maybe somebody being petty. Um, something. Uh, this is also you waiting for something, waiting for communication. This is a yes answer, but it's delayed news or challenging you challenging news but it is a yes answer it could come in one to eleven days to where you are victorious and whatever it is you're you're embarking on or whatever you're trying to do so you get a yes answer you get a proposal of some sort an offer to do something creative to this is thinking outside of the box creative and work also this is beauty beautician this is fashion this is also just um creative endeavor creative work this was tough you had to be tough in dealing with whatever this was or is 
what cards are we gonna go through okay and go here all right just to close out this reading so aries it look aries it looks like you get what you want there's a yes answer in terms of this week i'm just hold on is what the cards are saying be strong um temper yourself your outbursts your emotions what you say how you say it do your research follow up take the lead don't wait yeah text me don't call me um somebody could be saying that to you but it's like give them a call funny you got this card coming up i can't talk after 8 p.m sorry so like um oh some of you need to put boundaries up or somebody put boundaries up with you and now you're lurking spying trying to gain information but it says if you just don't fly off the handle here you'll get what you want you'll get the attention that you're seeking if you just move on walk off strutting your stuff leave if somebody's putting you in this energy then act as if it doesn't matter because it looks like they come back and they they offer you a lot this also could even be if this is professional put boundaries up with somebody in terms of work oh this could even be clients or this could be clients or people that you work for work with messaging you trying to contact you at the most inopportune times or just times where they just know they shouldn't be talking to you it says you need to put boundaries up this is what i have for you aries i hope that it resonates for you go over to the website book there ask a question or two by texting your question to the number below you can also catch me live every tuesday thursday and sunday night 9 30 p.m eastern standard time where i do collective reading and i answer your questions aries it says if you do this if you put boundaries up maybe this looks like love though if you put boundaries up with a love partner you get what you want you gotta you gotta draw the line in the sand this is what i have for you Take care, many blessings.